Welcome to the Maryland Convention Center here in Baltimore, the USA. The occasion, the United States Table Tennis Open Championships. And what a championships they've proved to be so far. All the big names turned out for this one. 3,000 players from 57 countries began the campaign here for major honors. Well, there's the lineup for the two semifinals. The second semifinal we'll see shortly. The first semifinal was a very tight one indeed. Chen is 1914. Well, only two points away from a big upset here. <laughs> Chen still has one serve to come. He'll be looking to try to get to 20 with that serve. I think he, he'll feel that's important at this stage. No, he desperately needs this one. Oh, it's off the end. And Chen just threw his bat down in disgust, really, because I wonder whether he's let a great chance go here. He's still got an advantage. But Voldner, he's such a good player, as you were saying earlier, Kevin, in tight situations, and I can tell you this is a tight situation. Well, this is it. This is what he's held his services back for. Whether he can make the advantage or not, we can only wait and see. Seventeen nineteen on Voldner's service. It's eighteen nineteen. Only one down now, and Chen, who had that uh, marvelous lead, it's being whittled away. Volner up to the table, didn't give the Chinese player any chance at all. He hit that so hard. With such topspin. Disguised with that arm on the service. And that's another beautiful piece of play by Volner. And the crowd responding to what is a marvellous piece of recovery. I just wonder whether... He middle name's Houdini because he's uh, really executed one of the great escapes at the moment as Voldner will it continue oh and look, he's continuing because he's now got one point ahead and poor Zibin Chen has let a marvellous advantage slip so match point for Jan Ove Voldner of Sweden the world number one the world champion who will be defending his world title this year. Oh! That's it! And Volner has gone through to the final over Zibin Chen. And what a marvellous recovery that was. Well, it really was a recovery, wasn't it? Because uh, Voldner was in all sorts of trouble, particularly in the first two games. He won it 3-2, as you saw. And now our attention turns.